Well, there are the obvious ones in the area of smart metering and smart city. But uh, we think at Swisscom there, are new, there will be appearing new solutions which we cannot think about, or which we cannot Im imagine yet. Well, first of all, the low power. So yeah. the low power consumption, which uh, finally uh, gives the possibility to to uh, reduce the, the battery size, and prolong the battery lifetime, or extend the battery life if you have the same uh, battery. And uh, we think also, compared to the traditional mobile uh, technologies, the, the cost effectiveness, <laughs> the cost effectiveness of the chipset and uh, the modules could uh, extend uh, the market size of uh, different applications. So this is uh, w where we think uh, that, that uh, the Internet of Things application could uh, evolve dramatically. We were very surprised uh, when we announced it uh, mid of March that we do this uh, pilot in, the, in Geneva and, and Zurich. The response was mass massive. We are currently talking to uh, more than 60 uh, interested uh, parties and already m around 10, p 10 companies have uh, decided to participate here. So the, the response was uh, immense. As I mentioned, first of all, that the low power co consumption uh, is uh, uh, one of the key features, as well the, the cost effectiveness. Yeah. But uh, we at Swisscom believe that there will be different uh, networks uh, in future for I IoT, and that uh, there are the low power wide area network will be uh, complementary to this to this network. Swisscom offered uh, already at the beginning a developer kit so that uh, the interested early adopters can already start developing their own solution. It consists of a base station so they can build up their own small local network which is connected then to our backend and they can already do the testing end to end. So this uh, allows them to do a star uh, fast integration and uh, also do some the first uh, test in their, in their environment.